Yeah. Please tell me that I can't, that I won't, that I fail, that I'll never make it out, yeah. Please tell me all the bad, never good, fill my head full of every single doubt, yeah. Please say What's up, y'all? It's your boy, the Sacktown Pack Hound, back at it with another rip. And today we have 23-24 Obsidian Basketball. Obsidian is one of my favorite favorite releases of the year i love how they use their colors i love their inserts and most of all i love that they have color blast in here so if you guys are not familiar with this product it is a 240 card base set these are going to range from between 325 to 400 in your local hobby shop um there's a couple of tougher pulls in here but the really short print and what we're really chasing are the color blast now what makes these different is that a lot of cards they either have parallels or they have prisms and that's really you know based on the borders or the color these have electric etch which is the design of kind of the borders of the card which you'll see as soon as i uh pull them out but they also change it up. They have some really lower numbered ones and those are um, floods, flood parallels. So they have several different ones, but the ones we're really hoping for are the, uh, what is it? Deep Sea Mojo and the Vibrant Mojo. The Deep Sea Mojo is to five and the Vibrant Mojos are one of one. It would be amazing to hit one of those vitreous and volcanics are the tougher pulls in here the vitreous i do believe is the die cut now i don't necessarily know if those are short prints or not but i know that they are really tough to pull but the super short print and what we are really hoping to pull are the black color blast if you guys watch the football version of this I actually was able and got lucky enough to pull an Anthony Richardson black color blast. I personally like the way that the black color blast and obsidian look better than the white prism color blast in my opinion, but a lot of people like the prism color blast. I like the obsidian black color blast. Um, if you guys missed last year, Mrs. Packhound pulled the biggest card she's ever pulled. I actually got it here. This is the card that she pulled last year from Obsidian in our box battle. The Anthony Edwards Matrix Material, one of one. What makes this one so unique? She got the entire Jordan logo in here. That is so rare. You hardly ever see that um and just what a person to pull so very few cards i keep in my pc that one is in my pc i took it from her <laughs> so you only get seven cards in here but three of those are gonna be hits so out of the seven cards you have two base cards two inserts or parallels two autos and one mem card so without further ado, let's get into this rip. If you guys have not already, please do not forget to hit that like, hit that subscribe. We are nearing 35,000 subs. We are on our way to 50. My, my ultimate goal, I would be flabbergasted if I was to reach 50,000 subs and we reach 50,000 subs, I will definitely be doing an insane giveaway. There's a couple shows coming up. Uh, we are not going to be at them set up, but we will be there buying at a lot of them. We do have our whatnot coming up. So definitely stocking up on inventory. These are, this one's a little bit thicker. So we'll save that one for a second. And let's get into it. All right, here we go. First one, I believe, is just the base. First couple. So Jordan Clarkson. So these are the base. So when you get the numbered cards, instead of being a prism or a, or a parallel, these little designs on the outside here will be a color. And that color is going to dictate what number it is. So purple edge or orange edge or whatever it is. I also like how it has the other players and the fans kind of, you know, etched in. So I like that a lot. 
So get our second one here. Ah, they're kind of slippery. Chris Middleton, I always get Chris Middleton. Oh my gosh, can I please get a Giannis Antetokounmpo, please? All right, I think these are the autos. So maybe we'll go from, yeah, we'll just go from here. Jet Howard, 149 out of 249. And that is the unbreakable patch. I do like how it has a nice little two color stripe in there because one thing about Obsidian, I, I will say more often than not, you are gonna get single color patches. So that's something I wish they would do a little better job of. Also, something I really, really do like, unlike a lot of products, especially like one of my favorite products, black, that is printed and made on this black stock. This is black chromium stock. This is usually really good quality. It is usually a lot better than black. Black is so difficult to grade. So these are a lot better. Bruce Bowen, this is old school right here. 64 of 75. Ooh, that's orange right there. Magmatic. Old school spur. Wrong spur though. We looking for we looking for Wimbinyama. Oliver Maxens Prosper, another dude that keeps following me. This is rookie eruption. 20 of 25. That's a green electric etch eruption. Nice player. Really wish it was Derek Lively because he is balling right now. We have two more left. Let's go, baby. Ooh, what's that? DeJounte Murray, orange flood. <clears throat> Excuse me. That's going to be number 299. So you see on this one how this has the green all along the etching. That's just a green electric etch. This entire card is orange, so that's an orange flood. Last card of this one, let's go. We need something big. We ain't got nothing big yet. Orlando Magic. Okay, Palo Bancaros, 54 of 75 Equinox. Not bad, not bad. Would have been nice if it was a rookie, but all right. We got to make it up with this one right here. Let's get that Wimbinyama Color Blast, baby. Whoever hits that Wimbinyama Color Blast, that's, that's going to be such a massive card. Get these two base cards out the way. Kyle Lowry, Mr. Dad Bod himself. And Grady Dick. What a name. This one's real thick. This should be our... This should be our patch. Tumani Kamara, 128 of 249. Yeah, just like I said, you know, a single color patch most of the time. This one is Eclipse. I do like the design though. I like how it's an elongated patch with the player on the side. Very, very nice. Come on, y'all. So far, I ain't got no cards I want to grade. Let's go. Come on. Ah, still don't. <laughs> Justin Holiday, 135 of 149. Galaxy Inc. Come on, we got to do better than this. Let's go. Okay, that's not bad. I'm in Thompson, 36 of 49. This should be an RPA. Oh, that's actually pretty nasty right there. That's a beautiful patch right there. I'm in Thompson, Purple Flood. 36 of 49. That is really nice. That's a nice one right there. That one might get great. Come on. Come on, Wimby. Ah, Steph Curry, though. Can't get mad at a Steph Curry orange flood. That's a uh, 4 of 99. Very nice. Last one. Last card mojo. Come on, baby. Oh, it's the right colors. Oh, maybe not. Ah, not Wimby. Joel Embiid, 42 of 49. Orbital. Ah, definitely not who we wanted. We're definitely on that Wimby Yama search, but not too bad. This is a really nice card. I really like that design and that patch. The, the purple and the red pop off each other really nice. I'm glad that they did the patch like that. Not not very often that you get a small window like that with a 
with a patch like that part of the o in houston it looks like so very very nice not too bad at all would have been amazing to hit a wimby but can't hit a home run on every single one so tell me what you guys thought about this product let me know what you guys thought about this rip myself and mrs pack hand will definitely be doing a box battle on this this is one of our favorite you know what i'm saying products so we will definitely be back with the box battle trying to see if we could pull something i don't know if we could ever pull something like this again but hopefully we can a lot of products coming out we are really waiting on optic it's supposed to be out at the end of june cannot wait for that product hopefully we pull it downtown for you guys but if there's any other products that you would like to see us rip let me know we will get it on here once again if you have not already hit that like hit that subscribe and until next time it's your boy the Sacktown town pack hound let's get it